If you want to master editing TikTok, in this video, I'm going to be going over how you can actually edit your very own TikToks inside of After Effects. If you guys do enjoy these videos, you want to support me, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. It does mean a lot. With that being said, I'm going to have a bunch of presets in the description for you guys for 100% free. So make sure to go check out the first link for that. With that being said, let's get right into it. All right, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to change the width to 1080p, and then you're going to want to change the height to 1920, uh, which is the inverse of 1920 by 1080. Uh, 60 FPS is fine, and then I'm just going to change my duration to something like 30 seconds. And then we have a timeline right here. We can see this is actually TikTok. TikTok resolution just right here it looks great and all we got to do is we just got to add our footage so for me what i'm going to do is i'm going to drag in a random TikTok thing right here so this is a recording that i made i'm going to drag it in just like this transformation on youtube and what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to cut out the portions that you're actually including in the video so for me it's going to be like this and then i'm going to take this then put them side by side and then cut out this and let's just say that this is the entirety of the TikTok that we want to work with here so make sure that we actually line it up with the beginning of the footage right here and you have two options what you can do is you can select both of these press s and just scale them up to make it a full screen or what you can do is you can just scale them out and just move the position up right here at the top of the video just like this and then what you can do is you can put like stock footage down below or like different gameplay uh for me that is what i do for my tiktoks i put stock footage down below and then i'll subtitle every single word as well as add transitions so i'm gonna quickly show you guys how you do that and uh, yeah that's pretty much my process so for me what i'm gonna do is i have like stock footage that i have i have so many different things so for me i talk about a gaming setup transformation so all i'm gonna do is i'm going to talk about where i have the setup transformation i'm just gonna scale it up remember that pressing s on a layer actually will allow you to scale up something so we got that right there the best setup transformation so on talk about the best setup transformation on youtube and then if i really want to i could add something else below so this is just you know a, just a little tip just use stock footage if you want just to keep the viewers engaged uh so for me i'm just gonna have that below this layer right here i'm gonna scale it up as well just like that the best just setup like that talk about the best setup transformation some on youtube some setups some set and talk about setups being horrible and then them being good but i just have that in the background and if you want you can add a transition all you got to do for that is press Control alt y above this and you just got to find one of my transition presets that i'll have in the description for 100 free and you just line up that third keyframe with the separation point so that'll be something like this it'll just some know, sort zoom through some like sort that and you know it's super clean you can include it you don't have to um from there let's just say you are wanting to do your subtitles now which is like the final step of my tiktok process um the you're just gonna want to like go of, through and let's just say you're like finding different words on, you, on youtube on your actual uh, tiktok and then from there you're gonna go to your text add something like the make sure that it's like white or just a standard color make sure you come up here to align put it in the middle just like this and you know you'll just cut it along each of these right here sorry and then you're gonna want to change the words as it goes along so like the best setup and you just go along and you literally change everything like say youtube and you can obviously change the color this is something that i do in my tiktoks i'll select all this come down here change this to red change my stroke to white super super basic the best setup transformation on youtube so that's just an example um obviously the best setup it's not exactly what i say but you kind of get the idea it's basic in that sense uh if you want to do a little animation to it like you want to actually have it come in for example what you can do is you can change the scale so you can have it start as let's say 29 percent and then one two three four five frames in you have it come up to 100 and then you do the exact same thing at the very end so let's say you do that so you just copy paste it and then select all these press f9 go into your graph and then if you do something like this where you're just selecting all these points you just kind of have them the best setup transfer you know it's just like a, it's it's a bit of an aggressive best, animation best but it's nothing special like it's just adding movement in general you know this is the just how you do subtitles the best setup transfer um if you were to want to apply to this one all you gotta do is just press copy bring it over here just paste and then you'll have to obviously adjust them the best setup transformation on best setup you know and then you just literally would come along and you would add it to all of these layers right here best setup transformation on you
So it's pretty simple um, once you actually get the hang of it. And then from there, all you got to do is add your transition subtitles to the entire thing. And then, you know, your stock footage, all that. Just uh, make sure there's always something for the viewer to focus on. That's the big thing about editing your TikToks. But from there, you just render it in your media encoder and it's pretty simple. You'd upload it to TikTok. Um, but yeah, with that being said, if you guys did enjoy the video, you learned something new, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. All the presets are in the description first link. So make sure to go check those out. And uh, with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy and I will see you guys in a future video on the channel. Peace out.